Don't tell your child, good job. Wait, what? It seems like such a natural and kind thing to say to your kid. Everybody says good job, but here's the problem. When we just tell a child, good job, they don't always know what we're referring to. For example, if your toddler is building a tower with blocks and you tell them, good job, are you praising their building skills or <clears throat> the fact that they didn't have a meltdown when the tower fell apart or for asking for help when they needed it? Giving validation and encouragement is a big part of the learning process. It can help to build confidence, but if we stay vague, we're missing out on a big teaching opportunity. So what should you say? Well, there are two points to keep in mind. Number one, be as specific as possible. And number two, focus on validating your child's efforts as opposed to their achievements or their abilities. In a previous example, instead of saying, good job, you might say something like, good job for not giving up when it became difficult. Good job for staying calm when the tower fell apart. Or good job for asking for help when you needed it. You don't have to always start with the words good job. You could say instead, I like how you did X, Y, Z. But if you're already saying good job, it's an easy place to start. When we praise the effort more than the outcome, we help children understand which skill we want them to develop. For example, when we praise their ability to stay calm when things get tough, it helps them understand that staying calm is a valuable skill that can help them be successful. I'd love to hear your thoughts on